Hello everyone. My name is Thomas from Catalan team, and today I want to show you how Catalan can help you troubleshoot test failures. Let's begin. Now, first of all, the best troubleshooting method is no troubleshooting method at all. This means that we should resolve problems even before they appear. For this purpose, Catalan Studio offers a feature called self-healing, which automatically finds correct locators whenever your task gets broken. In order to use self-healing, you can navigate to self-healing inside tab here, and then click on configure self-healing. By default, self-healing is enabled automatically for your project. We all know that even with self-healing, automated tests will eventually fail, and when they do fail, you will want to have all types of information at hand in order to resolve the problem. Now for that purpose, Catalan Studio offers you many types of information, screenshots, browser-based video recordings, and then time capsule. In order to enable these options, you can go to Execution tab here, and then enable these options, take screenshot, video recording, browser-based recording. Browser-based recording is a better method for video recordings than the window level based recording. And time capsule is enabled automatically for your project, so you don't have to enable that yourself. Once you have enabled self healing and then all kinds of information for troubleshooting test failures, you can begin to execute your test. I have prepared a test suite which contains a test case. In this test case, there are two problems. The first problem will get resolved by self-healing, but the second problem will make the test fail, and then we will see how various types of information offered by Catalog can help you identify and then fix the problem. So let's execute this test suite. As you can see here, this is the first problem. The day picker here cannot be identified by the locators now self-healing will automatically find the correct locators and then continue with the test execution. The second problem which is this go to homepage button. This cannot be identified by any locator so self-healing cannot help. So it will make the test fail. And then when the test fails, Catalan will gather all kinds of information like screenshot, time capsule, and video recordings. and they will be available after the test execution. So, the test execution has finished. Now you can go to the report folder and see the screenshots as well as the video recording. So this is the screenshot. And this is the video recording. So they will provide you with more information as to why your test fell. Now, if your test do fail because of broken locators and self-healing cannot help with that, Catalan Studio also offers you a feature called Time Capsule, which will capture the state of your application when a test fails. So this will help you Restore the state of the application when the test fail, And then you'll have all of the information you need in order to write a better and new locator. So this is not the screenshot. This is the state of your application which contains the HTML, the CSS. The time capsule also retains the visual aspects of your application so you can interact with this page and you can also capture new objects and then fix your broken test so this is how Catalog Studio can help you troubleshoot your test failures by self-healing, time capsule, browser-based recording and screenshot <laughs>